Hello, today I would like to show you something extremely, extremely nice that I managed to find on the AliExpress. From some time I was looking for a military style connector that it's going to give me a watertight and dustproof connection on the stuff that I'm going to use in the field. And I was looking for solution. Of course, the real military one are extremely expensive. They are very popular. Metal one that I sold as aviation plug. And they are on devices like a CB radio microphone. But I didn't like them. They are not watertight. They are not uh, dustproof. So there was not something that I want. And this is what I actually wanted, but never asked for. And as you can see in a really, really nice price, they are rated the IP68. Of course, for the Chinese stuff, I would not trust this in like a industrial application when you are having a reliability but for us for anything like and the DIY absolutely okay I'm going to trust in this I touch them I'm going to show you they looks good and I'm happy as you can see this is the model number the SP 13 and that is just a dimension, the 13 millimeter. As you can see, they came in a different pin numbers. And I'm going to show in second. You can have a two pin, three pin, four, five, six, seven, up to nine pin. And here is the specification for the for the connector by itself. And as you can see. This is a 13 millimeter. And this is how it looks like. This stuff, I believe it's completely wrong. Here we've got something about the 225 amp. That's absolutely some kind of garbage. Show you first the boxed one or in the real world application let's take a look at the real world world application so here i've got the military battery with a adapter and here is our connector as you can see there is a water seal very nice grommet that is going to be squeezed by rotating this and i'm going to show you that in the detail but that is how it looks like and as you can see absolutely amazing i add a little bit of the silicone here you can see to have it much more waterproof and it came with this very nice cap that is protecting the holes the female yeah, some people could say that this is a male because that's part it's like connecting but I would say that this is a female. So as you can see because it has this hole so the dust and if you are have it in the field in the dirt some stuff might go inside. That's why you've got this extremely nice cap. And how looks the other part? Actually, this is other device that I've got. And here I've got for my other military batteries. And here you can see how it looks like when it's connected. So even it's going to accept a quite beefy cable. Here is a smaller one absolutely accommodate i'm going to show you that in seconds so here we've got the connector 
and if I would like to change from the standard Golf radio battery, for example, I do not need to carry that beefy battery, and this small one is going to be enough, I can very quickly swap and to make the connection if you are going to take a look here is a white spot white marking and here on the female is corresponding one so no guessing you are going to mate them together exactly at this point and you make a nice waterproof seal so looking absolutely nice on the male end it do not have cap but here you do not have like nothing to stack you can just do like this if you've got something but here in the holes if you've got a sand that might be a problem so this is how it looks like as you can see everywhere they are gaskets and yeah you can of course make it there is no way to connect it wrong way because I'm using this on the military batteries where I've got two set of 12 volt batteries I choose a 4 pin so I've got a ability to use a 12 volt or 24 or 15 and 30 volt and yeah let's take a look how looks the brand new so we've got the male and the female the part with the gasket this is how it looks like here is our grommet our seal and as you can see this is a quite beefy one it can accept really really big wire and it can accommodate to a really small one you've got all this data i'm not going to measure it because you can read that from the from the page just open the sp13 and you are going to get the technical specs but as you can see it it can go uh, to a really narrow really small wire so absolutely perfect here is the inside and as you can see we've got another gasket there and our four pins each pins pin is nicely labeled you can see one two three four and on that part also so absolutely perfect and I believe this female part can be acting also as a panel mount because if we unscrew this then yeah this is just looking like a panel mount I believe we can drill a hole somewhere and just stuff it like that and screw from screw from the back to the enclosure and we can have a panel mount I'm not sure if that's uh, proper but looks like that's how it should work and you can bypass that if you've got a watertight enclosure so as you can see looking absolutely perfect solder it very well no problem at all and here is our male part exactly the same very very high ability to accommodate to a really small wire and here is the inside of course nice gasket so here we've got this grommet here we've got gasket and exactly the same 
like there we've got our pins and yeah this is how it looks like and here we've got another seal so yeah i'm going to tell you that i extremely like it and i'm very happy with this purchase of course in a year or two i can make a follow-up video and tell you how they are working does this marking came off but i'm very happy and just like a interesting point if you've got devices like this so when you've got the male and a female just a small tip free tip from me if you've got a battery on a or a power source i recommend you using the female or anything that have uh, do not have open pins because if you've got that end on the battery or the power supply then if you've got something metal in the bag you can attach and make accidentally short on the battery and if you've got the other part where the pins are not exposed then this thing cannot happen so here it is here you go sp13 plug from the aliexpress working really nice thank you very much for watching hope you find it interesting see you next time and bye bye